Hi, this is Risa and welcome to my kit review series. I'm super excited to be stitching and reviewing another of Lorna Bateman's kits, which I also bought on Etsy. This one's a pincushion kit called Dragonfly on Water Lily. Look how beautifully her kits are packaged and sent. Here's a sneak peek of my completed piece. What I like about this kit is that it uses a combination of ribbon embroidery and stump work, uh, which is great for beginners if they want to try both. So let's see what the kit includes inside. It seems like I've received two small packets, one with all the materials inside, and the second packet includes the small oak pin cushion which I ordered with the instructions. As you can see here is another one of Lorna Bateman's pin cushions and it's much larger in size. So remember to select the correct size when you're ordering on Etsy. I'm going to open the first package with the materials inside and as you can see there's a nice image of the embroidery piece that needs to be done. So let's uh, take out all the goodies. I love how everything is neatly packed and uh, that her kits are accompanied with beautiful pictures. I must say that the pictures are so nice you could uh, frame them as is even without um, embroidering the piece. They're really lovely and collector's items, I must say. So um, I'll put the instruction sheets aside. All of her kits come with instructions. Now let's open this. Okay, here is the material or the fabric and she's included silk dupion and a muslin backing. I have gotten familiar with silk dupion in her kits and I must say I really like it as a material. It has this really nice glossy finish um, to the embroidery pieces and uh, gives it a really nice classy look. So the second little packet includes the ribbons and the threads that you will need to embroider the piece. So the pink ribbons for the lotus and all the threads that you need to complete the kit. Now the third little packet includes, uh, let's see, we have the needles neatly organized. We have the beads for the dragonfly and we have two metallic threads. So here it is, all of the materials you would need to complete the piece. Now let's open the second packet which has the oak pin cushion. Okay, here we have it. And the instructions that come along with the pin cushion. Really good quality oak here. So there we have it. Now looking at the instructions, she has a list of all of the items that's included. So this is the pattern here that you can trace, but I've ordered the kit that includes the pattern screen printed onto the fabric. A numbering of the lotus flower for the ribbon embroidery. Then a set of instructions on the ribbon stitches that you will need. And of course, they also include other ribbon stitches that not necessarily used for this kit, but uh, a good reference if you want to work on other ribbon embroidery projects. And finally, we have a third set of instructions, which are thread embroidery stitches, which, so all of the instructions are very detailed and easy to refer to when you're working on Lorna Bateman's projects. So I hope this quick review was useful. Here's a sneak peek of my stitch along video which accompanies all of my kit reviews on my channel. Um, I hope you'll find it useful. You can access it by clicking on the link above. Join me as I stitch Lorna Bateman's beautiful dragonfly on Water Lily Kit. Thank you for watching this video and as usual don't forget to click on the subscribe, like and notification buttons to get alerted on my new videos. 
see you again next time bye bye